What's good, internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to Let's Mess With the Forest. Uh, this is the third episode of this uh, nonsense, and I'm going to continue back into my game. I made it back last time just barely as night was falling again, and then hung out all night on a rock, not getting attacked. And now it is back to being daytime. And it is back to hopefully building more stuff. That is kind of the plan for today, or for, you know, what I'm doing here. But I'm not sure exactly how long I have before night is going to fall again. You can see here, I did build a fire pit. I am the champ who runs the camp, which is this little tiny-ass thing here and this stuff. I tried to build one of these, and those assholes knocked it over and got lit on fire, which is pretty funny, unfortunately. I, I didn't get that on video, uh, and that's kind of a shame. But I, I got full health. And I got full, uh, thirst meter and full, almost full, uh, stamina and that kind of stuff. But I don't have much else. I got this head in here still. Circuit boards. Um, I don't have too much else from when I previously started a game, so this is gonna go real shit, right? I'm just gonna get attacked again at night and then have to sit here out on this rock, or I guess this rock over there, and they can't reach me there. So, otherwise, like, what the fuck do I do, you know? Just wait it out. Like, I wanted to build this effigy, and it just didn't happen. I didn't get enough sticks. I barely had enough sticks and rocks to build this damn fire pit, which I can keep tossing leaves into. But, oh, there's the first fucker. There is the first... Hey, buddy. You want to dance? We've been through this. I have an axe. You guys are idiots. No, there's going to be more of you. Where you at, bro? Where you at, bro? There we go. Nope, nope, nope. And we go back to hanging out on this fucking rock all goddamn night. And being cold and wet. Because I'm standing right here and they can't get me. So they'll just stand there and watch me. And they won't actually get up here. Which is, you know, there's already three of them. So, I get to sit here for like ten minutes. See, he's, he's on fire, which is hilarious. That is real funny. Unfortunately, he can't break my fire pit. Like, he, he can break that standing sticks deal. But he can't break the fire pit, and I did have to sleep. So this, the reason that this day is shorter, I did have to sleep, because eventually you run out of stamina uh, meter, and you gotta, you know, get some rest to get it back. So uh, my other options were not great, so I slept and killed half my daytime, because obviously at nighttime these assholes will come and attack me. I'm stuck here for the full course of the nighttime for this video, which is, you know, shit. So I'm gonna have a big jump cut here as I just sit here. And take some painkillers and just watch my hunger meter and thirst meter just decrease over the course of the evening as I just sit and wait, which is, like, tedious. So, I think my goal for the next day is to build a damn cabin and have, like, a house to be in. And that could be, you know, for purposes of having a door and sleeping would totally be great. But in the meantime, I'm just hanging out here watching these assholes run all over my camp, even though I am... The champ who runs the camp. Look at all them motherfuckers. That's what? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? It's like nine of them. And they all want me dead. And that's kind of insane. They don't seem to want to go into the water onto this rock, so I should at least be good from that. But shit, man. It's a lot of waiting. A lot of just waiting around. So I there there's one thing that I didn't notice before that I totally have a map. And that I can look down at this map here and say, hey, here's what's here's where I've been. I guess. And I, I think the pin is where I currently am. More idiots getting lit on fire is pretty funny. Uh, but not really helping. They're just getting lit on fire over and over again, which is real good. But not really helping me out here, waiting for this daytime to... From, I think, that direction is where the day breaks. And there we see the sun finally begins to rise. These dick bags are still floating around. My fire went out. I'm pretty hungry and pretty thirsty, and I kind of have one single solitary goal right now, and that is to build a small cabin with 13 logs. Log cabins, 82 logs, I'm not doing that, but I can certainly do a small cabin that would be, be you know, a place to hide inside of uh, during the evenings uh, with 13. I think 13 is totally plausible. Just gonna kind of wait for some of these guys to clear out here as the day breaks. There's still so many of them. That's real bad. Come on, guys. The sun's up. You can leave me alone now. 
Seriously, go back to your homes. Please disperse. Go back and do what you do. I need to eat some fucking food. And I need to build myself a log cabin. Come on now, sun's up. Skedaddle. Well, I suppose this is kind of a problem now, isn't it? Like, how do I even progress if I can't have to deal with 15 different guys here in my damn camp, not leaving me alone? I, I can head toward that location there, uh, along the shoreline, but otherwise I'm kind of boned, to be honest. And that's disappointing, video game. You would think full fucking daylight here, they would just piece the hell out, but they're not, so... I guess we'll head toward that location over there and see if that's anything interesting. And if I die and lose my damn save file, that's kind of is what it is. Perhaps this is just a very bad place to build a location uh, in the first place. Cause they aren't going away, so fuck them. Fuck them. Yeah, they're just going to follow me. They're just going to fucking follow me. Not cool, you guys. Not cool. Don't appreciate. So it's, it's like, did I build my house too 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 close to your house? Sorry. Well, they seem to have not wanted to leave me alone, which is a problem. So this video could be ending, what the fuck, very shortly here. As we head into this building. Fuck off. Leave me alone, lady. Leave me alone. I got no food, I got nothing. Nothing. What? Yeah. How about that? How about that? Axe of the face. I will tell you again. You don't want none. You don't want none. This is terrifying. What is the point of any of this? I'm going to die. Again. Yeah, they're just, uh... Alright, well. Lesson learned. Don't build your camp anywhere near any other existing structures, otherwise you will never get rid of all these assholes every damn day, which is a shame, so most likely in the next episode we're gonna start over. We're gonna start the hell over because uh, I'm never gonna get out of here. Like, I'm never gonna escape 15 guys who want to eat my face off. Uh, which is pretty good, so that sucks. I suppose we should go meet our fate here because we're not gonna make any real progress otherwise. Uh, because they don't want to leave us alone. They don't want to leave us alone. I got I got no food and no water. I got nothing in my inventory that's going to help me out. I got one thing of booze and raw meat, which is not going to help me. So, they apparently can't get up here, which is funny, but that doesn't help me at all. Like, I can't sleep in here. Phone's going off. I, I can't sleep in here, so I can't regain my stamina, and I, I can't cook. So, none of this is going to pan out like I want it to pan out. So, that sucks. Let's just go die. Alright, you guys. You, you Really? Have at it. Fucking have at it. Don't care anymore. And I'm dead. And I'm dead. So, that should be the game over? Oh, no. I'm getting dragged into the cave again. Oh, good. Because that wasn't enough of a damn problem last time. Which, I don't know that I have the patience to play through that terrifying a bit of cave stuff again. And here we are, yeah. Got the light. And we, we've done this. I've been through this. I just wanted to build a log cabin. That's all I wanted. And they're stupid enough, again, to leave my stuff with me. Again. And I'm back down here. Again. Let's go fight that weird thing with the, um, the eight feet. And then die, and then be done with this episode, because I'm just kind of annoyed at this point. Painkillers aren't going to help me here, I need actual food. Not enough leaves. Oh man, I'm like one leaf short of building this fire I could totally cook meat on and then survive. I'm one leaf short. That sucks. That is just the most depressing thing in the world. I don't understand the point of allowing me to live through that encounter. Doot doot! A second time. Like, I don't, I don't get that. Just, at that point, just kill me, you know? Like, was was there a thing that I missed out here in the caves that I had to get to? Because, honestly, I just wanted to get the fuck out of the caves uh, when I was in here last time. Hey, buddy! Let's get nice up and close and personal with you here. Oh, he's, he's not here this time? 
Huh. That's weird. Well, there's the rope. Get up there! What the hell are you doing? You fucking clown. Yep. And then we climb. But we already did this, this whole thing. It has already been done. So, I escaped it again, but I'm going to starve to death. I don't have any food. And, uh, yeah, this is going real well. Like, at some point, do you just pass out and die? Is that what happens? I don't actually know. Lizard man! Getting this lizard cooked. Getting some food. I don't know. Uh, perhaps we'll find some somewhere else to set up a base camp here in the forest. Uh, as soon as we get some food in our stomach. You know what? Let's try to build a cabin. You know what? That was the whole mission of this episode anyway. Let's try and build a damn cabin. Fuck it. 13 logs. Let's get to work. My only goal now is to build this shit before night falls. Can it be done? Can it be done? Falling the wrong way! I have built it! It is the tiniest log cabin in the world, but I have built it. So now I can totally cop some Z's in here. And, uh, can I lock this door? Probably not. That's a problem. That's a problem. What I really want is this deal right here. The log cabin. But that's 86 logs to get that. And there's like no real door in that. It's just a bunch of, you know, there's windows and shit. But no real defenses there. And having a, def a defensible position is one of the biggest problems. Lizard, come back. You're good food. Oh, whatever. Whatever. I'm out of stamina here. So, I don't know. I guess I'm going to try sleeping here and seeing if the natives come this way. Because, you know, this is where the exit of the cave is. It's right fucking here. So... Whether or not the natives are going to come and uh, invade this area to come eat my face off, I don't know. So I suppose let's find out. Let's go in here and close that door and then hit Z to see how, see how it goes. Because honestly, I think there are more defensible positions to get into than... And I, I can't sleep again, which is a kind of problem. Alright, full of food, but still need water. I think we can try to... No, we, we, we can't sleep anymore, so that's unfortunate. So, I don't know. Uh, we'll pick it up again next time uh, in, in the forest. I think I'm going to keep going with this save until they actually kill me, because now I actually have supplies right outside of the cave. So, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Until then, until next time, as always, thanks for watching. I'm your host, Sack Club. Uh, this is The Forest, and I'll see you next time right here on this channel. And I'm out.